years of being in CBD with these rings were confirmed. It was this hair, it's much more cheaper than temporary locks and it does the same work. And it's affordable. Good morning. Okay, it's actually good afternoon. Hi guys, welcome back to the vlog. My name is CJ. I do beauty and lifestyle vlogs here on this channel. If you're new here, hi. If you're a returning subscriber, thank you so much for sticking around. So I'm starting a new vlog today and uh, the main agenda of the vlog is just to literally go for... I'm going to retouch my hair and do my nails. It's like a small self-care. And then I have a few errands to run in town and then that should be it. So I want to take you along rather than I want to give you info on the hair when I get back probably because this is better than is it called um artificial locks or these ones are called artificial locks the other one is called temporary locks so this one's is better it's much cheaper serves the same purpose and almost look the same as that other style so that's basically what i'm going to do today in cbd run a few errands come back and then yeah show you guys what you're going to go about so yeah that's pretty much it for the day i don't like this weather um it's i don't flourish in cold weather and rainy season it's so late i don't go to town this late but there's just a reason why i must go to town today and that's why i'm going so i decided to just combine everything together otherwise i'll see you guys when i get back bye So, uh, <laughs> welcome back to the vlog. I'm trying to fix my angle because there's this lighting behind me that is a bit distracting and if I switch it off, it's going to get dark. And my kitchen is in a mess because tell me why it's 12. It's actually 1 p.m. in the afternoon and I've not even done like anything in my house just because there was no electricity. It has been drizzling the whole day. But anyway, we'll fix that. No problem. Okay, welcome back to the vlog. So, uh... When I left here, I left off. I was going to go to CBD, do errands, and probably go to the salon. I actually did go to the salon. It rained, and my fears of being in CBD with these rains were confirmed. It was raining. Like, I left CBD <laughs> at around 6.30, and I had to walk all the way from CBD to home because there was no vehicle. There was so much traffic, and I figured, you know what? I cannot sit here and wait for the rain to fall on me. As I wait for traffic to get home at 1 a.m., with flood so mm. my home from cbd is not that far yeah mm. it's like a 30 Can minutes I kind of walk so tuliji babash let me talk first okay we nice ourselves so yeah i'm here to show off my hair this is what i went and did it's like a low bun with this what that doing. Doing. so i'm just here to give you details of mm. the hair like to hair. give you like detailed info on mm. the hair this mm. is the front okay so this hair is much more cheaper than temporary locks and it does the same work and it's affordable more than temporary locks and you just do it serves the same purpose okay even if you look at it, it doesn't look like it's not temporary locks it looks like it's the, almost the same thing this is called milo braid by i think darling or angels you know angels because darling scratches my hair a lot by angels it's called milo braid by angels 
Um, so what they do is like um, <laughs> if you've ever done forelocks before, these are like tiny, tiny forelocks, all right. But these ones you can retouch them, and then you can. Making noise. So you can retouch them on a monthly basis or on a two monthly basis, just depending on how your hair uh, beats up faster. Uh, this time I went on a research very quickly because uh, I had applied gel here and it was turning white and I was just not liking it. So I ended up going and washing it and retouching it, but it wasn't due for a retouch. But again, I, normally I take like two months before I do my retouch because my hair doesn't uh, grow that fast. Baba, can you hush? So the hair plus the braiding inclusive will cost you three five, okay? Mm -hmm. Three five. It will cost you four k, but if you say that CJ sent you, it will cost you three five. Or you can go go ahead and you know do a little bit of bargaining. But three five is actually the best price for retouch is six hundred. Every time you go for a retouch, it's six hundred shillings. Also depending on the style that you choose. So if it's just like simple style six hundred, if you have like complicated styles, you need rubber bands and all that, it will probably go up to eight hundred. But it's not more than eight hundred. But six hundred is the minimal retouch cost. Okay. Yeah, so yeah, that's pretty much it. And then the lady who does my hair, it's done at River, is that River Road? Yeah, I'll just say it's River Road, but not really River Road, like it's at Ngiriyama Road, near Kyo House, uh, first floor. So I'm going to leave her details here, her number. She's called Marcy. She does um, home calls if you want, she can do that. But for this particular hairstyle, you have to call her prior so that she can prepare the hair because there's a way that it's prepared because it's, it's, it's more like a kinky, but there's a way it's done. So somebody is disturbing me with calls. So there's a way it's done. So you have to call her prior like a day before and just tell her that tomorrow will be coming or can you come and do my hair? So when you call her to come and do your hair at home, obviously you have to pay for transport, but that's it. And then how long is going to last? Uh, it can even last up to a year. The last time I had them before, I did this before in a black color before I did the temporary locks. Uh, I loved the service for this because temporary locks are expensive for nothing, uh, if, if for my opinion. It serves the same purpose because you cannot redo, you cannot reuse the temporary locks. So why should I pay 7K? And for 7K for temporary locks, I'll get a length like that is like here or shoulder length. But these ones are longer. You can see that it's already sh almost shoulder length and they are folded. So it's like, you know, it's, it's a bit longer and it's only going to cost you like 3, 5 or 4K uh, on the higher side. But again, it's reusable. You can wash it. You can, you can curl it. Like definitely all the styles that you can do on a lock, you can do on this hair. So if you want to get yourself low budget locks, these are for you. The last time I did them, I loved them. I was obsessed. It was in black and they were so good. Uh, and then I decided to do temporary locks and then I spent a lot of money and I was like, you know what? I'm never doing temporary locks again. So I'm back to this. So that's pretty much it for the hair. Oh, all in that, uh, I was around CBD. I was doing a little bit of uh, errands. Normally, I like going to Dubois. Because I sell jewelry, I like to go to the boys to check what they have, like the common um, pieces in place so that I don't repurchase things that people can actually get from there. So I like getting my way there one or two times. Or even sometimes when I get like they have very unique pieces that I'm not able to have at that particular time, I could get some from there at an affordable price. But basically, I just go there to just check what's available, what people are buying, and what's so common that people are not buying that much so that I don't repeat the same styles in my store. Also, I got, I've been running, I've been meaning to get myself a book tape for the longest time. So I got this book tape. I've tried using it, Kidogo too, just to see how it works, but it, it actually does hold. I just need to study how I'm supposed to use it and then just use it to dress up. Yes? Yeah, fix me socks. Tell Brianna. So this was 350. It's, it's the smaller one. It went for 350. Then I stumbled upon shoes because I don't have... Um, I told you guys I'm struggling with... Um, wearing closed shoes if you are new here i'm struggling since i gave birth my closed shoes don't fit and uh, i'm just wearing the same size if i buy a bigger size it becomes loose and if i wear the same size it will pinch so i've been struggling with getting the perfect shoe so i decided to just be wearing open shoes so i got these these cute um low heeled flats all right i don't know if you guys can see them clearly 
the lighting is so but they are like cream in color let me just focus a bit yep okay so this is how they look like pretty cute all right and they're low heeled so i got these ones in the streets of du bois they went for because i got uh three pairs for 1100 then I got these hummies. I, I do have hummies, but the ones I have are very, very flat. They're not, these are a bit thicker. The ones I have are very, very flat and they're very light. So I decided to get these. Though these ones, nearly gongwa, but I just love them because of the color. But clearly, the Meishaisha Kidogo, but they will serve the Papa Spear for a while. So I got this also. Then I wanted to get shoes for my daughter because my daughter is wearing a bigger shoe than I am. So I decided to get her these ones only to get home and they're not fitting her. They're also small. And these are bigger size than me. So they are, they are so cute. I love they they're so they are new. All right. Cute, good color, perfect my color choice, but they don't fit, so I have to sell them to someone else. But that's what basically I got from the boys. Apart from that, I don't think there's anything else I got, but the purpose of this video was just majorly for the hair. And yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, also, I've not been having lights for the for the first few days, so I want to to I've gotten to my, my fridge. So many of my tomatoes are spoiled, so I want to sort them out and then blend the ones that I can blend so that I don't go they don't go to waste. But that's just pretty much it. So yeah, if you like this video, please give it a thumbs up. I'm gonna see you in my next video. Bye. Bye. okay so here are the hummies but this is not the original color they are wet i washed them yesterday and they have not dried yet so they're a bit wet so you can see the browns i love browns i'm wearing a brown tight the shoes are brown they complement my skin tone and that's pretty much it i also love these ones they're so cute so this is the reason why i have to give away these shoes see that space they have that space and then they're a bit too baggy for me so i have to give them out but they're pretty they're so beautiful they're new they're just the perfect meals for me but they're a bit big then they're loose they wouldn't look so good on me when i'm walking so i have to give them out